You guys, he napped until 6.30. What kind of night lies in store for me? Uh. Happy Saturday. We are having some breakfast. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, my husband is stuck dealing with some work issues to hopefully stop some alerts from bothering him every five minutes, so. Hey guys, it is finally nice enough to go for a walk. It won't last long. Sebastian is all the way over there. I don't know if you can see him. Come on, buddy. He's just standing there staring at me. <laughs> oh, here he comes. I don't know if you can see him yet. Can you see him yet? There he is. <laughs> it is almost 60 and the sun feels heavenly, but it's gonna go back to raining every single day. This is our only little window of niceness. Slow down before you get here or you fall in the mud. Ooh, that was a big run. Why were you stopped over there? Oh, I didn't know I was supposed to say anything, but I waved my arms instead and you, you got the signal. All right, let's continue our walk. playtime and nap time. Ooh, you might wonder why this is knocked down on the floor. Anyway, Sebastian is going potty right now. That's my knitting bag. We took a nice long walk today while it was sunny. Um, it felt so nice that I actually took my sweater off at one point. We went 2.6 miles though. I was pushing him in a stroller. It actually ended up longer than it needed to be because one of my gloves fell down while we were walking and I had to loop back. But I've got a good deal with him who is going putty and I'll be right back. Guys, he napped until 6.30. What kind of night lies in store for me? 
it is 9.20. They just finished watching one of the Muppet movies. I was doing Animal Crossing. I had an empty spot for a new villager, so I was visiting lots of tropical abandoned islands until I found somebody that I could deal with. So Hamlet, I think, a little hamster. He looked really cute. I've heard of him. I think he was popular in the last Animal Crossing game. He'll be moving in. He's not who I ultimately want, but I was sick of going to island living. That was number 10. Anyway, so yeah, nap. I'm continuing on with my low-key method I've tried for the last couple days. We just have to play in the bedroom, on the bed, be chill. I wait for him to be ready. Sometimes it works. Sometimes it doesn't. Be gentle, guys. Yesterday it did not work. He eventually went downstairs without napping and we had a horrible, horrible night. It was terrible. At one point I just left. I left the room and went, back, went downstairs until he came down creeping and my husband put him back upstairs. And I went upstairs and he was being awful and I had to take away his toys and then he started sobbing and then I let him hold one of his toys in bed if he promised to go to sleep and then he earned them back by falling asleep clutching his transformer. <sighs> it's hard being three, almost four. But today he played and played and played and we were up there for a super long time but at four o'clock he asked to lay beside me and rest and listen to the Animal Crossing headphones because I had just turned that on after waiting for two hours for him to nap and he just fell asleep sweetly. Um, but yeah, he slept like two and a half hours and then I eventually woke him up because my husband had ordered some Mexican food for us. We came down just in time, it was five minutes away. I had some delicious Mexican food. He got some desserts for us to share, but I was so full I could only eat a couple bites. So it's super pia and churro. <laughs> But tomorrow, probably just chores and lots of sewing. I need to make more sewing, more masks. Definitely for my husband. He goes out on more errands, but more for all of us because eventually we will be released down into the world and we will need to wear them. But for sure my husband, I know he just wore his the other day and it's probably in the wash now because I don't see it out. Because you gotta wash those after you've been out. So I'm gonna do that. I have that fabric I got from Etsy. I'm gonna still be using hairband elastics. I'm so glad that I found a certain kind. Let me see if I have some up here on Amazon before they all went out of stock. This is not the card they came on. I stuck them on here, but this is like one of them. If you cut the beads off, the whole thing unravels into a really long, like two foot long piece of elastic. So each one of those can make a ton of the masks that I'm making because I only need two things about this big for mine. I cut this open like right there so that it has even more length and it gets sewn to the two corners. So yeah, that's gonna be great. I'm gonna probably cut up most of those. I pulled out the pink ones to maybe use because I've been sacrificing some of my good hair bands to sew the masks we already have. But you know what? I might need it more for the masks. I have plenty of hair ties. I actually ordered some from Claire's of uh, this fabric kind, like stretchy nylon that's like rolled. I feel like this would work for masks too, so if there's some colors that I wouldn't want to wear, but I really like these in my hair. I wear this one a lot because of rainbow. It's like perfect. I don't know if you've noticed, but I'm starting to redo the top. This dark purple is going away, the blonde's going away, and it is going to be this blue gray, like a sky, a cloudy sky, and then the rainbow underneath. So we'll see how it goes. Well, the kids have been reading books. Jax just wanted to spend some time with his brother. Surprise, surprise, though he's being super bossy. <laughs> but I'm gonna deliver allergy medicine. Here's your allergy medicine, Sebastian buddy. Sebastian was calling me yeah. mean. Mommy was called, Sebastian was calling yeah, me yeah, mean for reading. For yeah, Sebastian did. was calling me mean for reading the book to him. I don't feel like he, reading books to you anymore. He's just tired and he's three. Can you apologize to your brother? Why do you call me mean? Sebastian. 
Tell your brother you're I sorry. I could have just left and said good night to you. You see that posture that means he's really tired. Chew that. Chew it. You want to say good night to everybody? Chew that. I don't want you choking. Good night. Can you say good night to everybody? Good night. Wash hey. your hands. You know what I always say right now? I say stay healthy, stay happy, stay at mm -hmm. home, and what don't forget to wash your hands. To wash your hands. <laughs> Come on. Don't forget. <laughs> wash your hands. Okay.